uh, stop calling me. Stop texting me. Stop trying to communicate with me because from now until the foreseeable future, my loose behind will be parked in this bed like an 18-wheeler truck. You're not going to get my happy hiney out of bed no matter how hard you try. You could call in the entirety of the NFL's New York Giants football team to attempt to haul me out of bed. But it will be no use. <clears throat> Sorry. Daniel Jones' weirdly shaped quarterback face will be no match for my propelling limbs. The son of a gun won't be recognizable after he's met my legs. I will hold on to this bed for dear life if that means I don't have to live it. I'm willing to stay in this bed for so long that giant dark ulcers will start to develop. After a while, those ulcers will get so bad that my bones will pop out of them. And after 6 to 12 months, my bones will become so weak and cracked that I'll be stuck in this very bed for hopefully the remainder of my days. Make sure the only people who come in and out of this room are the DoorDash employees who bring me my Popeyes. And the nurse I'll call in to install the catheter. If people at school ask where I am, tell them I died. Maybe then they'll start to like me. Do me a favor and send this video to mom and dad. Thanks, champ. This is the last time you hear from me, so kiss my what? ass. Dummy? I forgot to lock the door. That's it. Get out of bed. Give me your phone. Why are you? Yeah.